And again, it's a different type of performance, as you've mentioned, and the lads are showing they can do this to keep the points coming. Yeah, you need to. I mean, everyone wants to play brilliant football, score loads of goals and win comfortably, uh, but you have to grind out these points. And like, Come the end of the season, these, these points are massive. Um, so we're looking to just build them up and, uh, like I say, move on to the next game and uh, try and try and get the three points in that one. What's it like to come back to a place where you've been before and, and score? Well, to be fair, it's the first time I've got a result back here, so that was uh, that was pleasing. Um, I've not not been here for uh, like five years now, so it was uh, it was nice to to get a point at least. Um, so I was pleased with that, and you can think you could see when my celebration, I was pleased to get a goal. Um, so no, it's, it's it's always good coming back to um, your old teams, but no, the, the focus was uh, was on the three points, and unfortunately we couldn't quite uh, get all three. Got to mention that pass from Joycey, that was unbelievable, as well as the finish. Yeah, lovely. I, I said to Jamie shouting, um, but uh, I don't think he did. I think he just uh, chucked it in a, in a direction, but it was exactly what I wanted. Um, it, was, it was a great little dink over, uh, exactly what I was uh, aiming for, and uh, thankfully I put it away. And nearly 1,400 Carlisle fans, you can't not celebrate in front of them. Exactly, yeah, I had to try and celebrate in front of all of them. I uh, ran pretty much the full length of the pitch, but no, it's enjoyable. They've all come down three hours on Boxing Day, so uh, if you can't celebrate with, with the fans, then uh, when can you? Is it worth a booking, something like that? Definitely. <laughs>